It is often considered a dead language, but often associated with culture, Latin refuses to go extinct. Up until the 18th century, scientific texts were published in Latin. Nowadays, its main use comes in Vatican official documents and in at least two radio stations, Finland's YLE and Bremen Radio in Germany. But according to the new secretary for the Pontifical Academy for Latin, assuming that the language is dead is wrong. The Latin language is alive because many people study it and helps them cultivate their thoughts and better their lives. At the same time, it is a language that in some aspects of the written and spoken word, it is still in use. Latin has always had close ties to the church. Though it is no longer common to hear mass in Latin, some of the words and terms are similar to today. For the Pontifical Academy for Latin, the language is best for theology. It is a very democratic language because it is international. Latin has fixed structures and is particularly adept to express and set concepts with dogmatic theology. Latin is an aesthetically beautiful language, and when in use it is the phonetic equivalent of ornate and harmonious architecture. The Pontifical Academy for Latin began their work on November 21st. It will organize scientific and educational events to promote the study of Latin. The Academy will also offer language courses and host conferences and artistic events to show the language has not died.